Hello everyone and welcome back to Tyranny. There we go. Come around to press that tab key and highlight everything. So one of the loading screen tips this time was Bane do large amounts of arcane damage. So your Nora defenses won't be able to save you from that. Something on those lines. Yeah, so here's the thing. I don't have decent arcane defense, actually. Maybe not so much damage against anything else, but I at least have arcane defense. It's like, what do you have going for you? Pairs of Frost. Makes sense. Pairs of Frost, Pairs of Frost. Pairs of Frost. Yeah, he's our tank. And he hasn't really been taking that much arcane damage. Like, I think... Bane will probably be the easiest thing I've ever fought, to be honest. Because they'll just... They don't really do that much. And they have, oh no, this one's strong against this, and weak against that. Except it doesn't really matter. <laughs> magic still hurts them as soon, much as magic hurts anything else. It's mostly due to the fact that most of our spells are, well, you're doing frost damage, but it's also doing fire damage. And most things that are weak against frost are, you know... Strong against fire, so it's like, oh, well, I'll just use this, and it does the same thing as... It does both elements, because Frostfire. Because Frostfire is one of the best sigils in the game. But, yeah. So, anyway, left hand's crossing. Maybe now there's actually stuff to do. Hi, random merchant. Let's go visit the forge. Anyway, hi. As you approach the entrance to the left cross, since you can see two fairies talking intently with each other, one point. It's no officer tarts. Don't forget for to stay here. Being too unstable on business and suffering because of it. If I have to pay one more toll or hand over more guard money, I want two rings to rub together. There's the thing, the game expects us to have just now arrived at left crossing, I think. Instead of, you know, having been here, having the spire for how long? <laughs> Like, probably half my videos? Where would we go? There's a single place in the church that's safe. Hey, we could go to Central and keep rumors. The storms... They'll have died down. How about... Go and stop speaking when she sees you. Faith on you. You grace us will be present. She bows and smacks her sister on the back of the head after a moment. The young man bows too. What seems to be the issue here? Though my desire to leave the town before its leaves causes it to collapse in on itself? Oh, Faber, I'm not one to speak ill of man, but the despair currently can troll left and cross. I'm not sure they're entirely qualified for the job. He's very stern watch over everything. No one I know is happy having them around. Last time I was here, everyone was pretty happy that I gave control over it. Not last time I was here, everyone was very happy that it was the despair, not the score, Carlos. No, he said if I wish my last week in the score, of course, might even be better. No, it wouldn't. You're certain you need to deal with them. The current despair leader in town is Ventara. However, if you need to speak to someone, I suggest you find Adrian. He's the true leader of the town, fair knowledgeable, and low, very low headed. Both of them can be found over there. Ventura lies being outside, so she can maintain control over everything that's happening. And it's probably his house, no Ventura was stomping around. Who are you, anyway? Me, I don't I'm just a simple, humble merchant. Alright, by the way, can you tell me anything about the sale? I forgot about the sale. I don't know if I want the other merchants here, might. I forgot about the sale. Dream so there has to be someone who has seen their travels. And what can you tell me about Leopard's Crossing? What's there to say? It's just 
is coming into its own at the center of common sense and it's frequent by merchants from all over. Recent plus events trade is all but dried up around here. My pleasure, my partner. Good luck in your endeavors, and may you always have a ring within reach. Herp, herp, herp. Hi, people. I'm back. You have anything new since I arrived? You still have your great spell, which. Yeah. Hey, I could get her fire tongue, couldn't I? Get your fire tongue. Poisonous. Bam. Oh god, the fire train. Let's see, what do you have again? You have the stuff I left you. But that's about it. Meh. Meh, I say. I can go back there and get my buff. But I think it's finally time we go actually... You know. We can actually go over here and talk to people. Woo. We have to visit the port found. We need to go talk to the... Them, see if there's an actual quest for me to do. I have been told you have that request. Paper, you have returned. You know when the forge found masters arriving. You should protect the forge who are here, not watch for the arrival of anyone new. I've given that test item to handle. It keeps him busy. See, enough that he generally leaves me to my duty in peace. Plus, it makes him feel more important than he actually is. If you want to know more of our rival sweep of him, I should the fortune of the bell. Well, then that's him up. Tread well. I mean, travel well. So he's not in his house. Okay. But fine. Do, 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 do. And this should just be this, right? Oh. Marshmallows. Chris War used to be. Maybe it was this one I was thinking of. Yeah, that's the one. Hi, anything new? I'm Javelin. Do, 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 do. Eh, nothing very new. Spares are great for um, both core and expression. Core serves to determine the magic type that determines the fat and high people. As for the faith binders, hell. Oh, you're already hell. Then it turns approaches you, her leaf five. Moving fluid fluidity as she walks, she stops before you with her stance so unsure. You see she's standing lightly on her feet, ready to move if necessary. She don't take her eyes off of you, but you know she is there, acutely aware of her surroundings. Fate by made the fires of your forge never cool. I told her pass for cross. Where is my ears of your hand to remove the eater's storms from Central Stand Keep? That was no small feat, I would ask you how you did. Sure, but I'm sure you have more important things to talk about. Usually in the port, I have never heard of a uh, Faith Binder company is something of such significance. It's hard to meet some of such distinguished deeds. What can this ruin the flame do for you? Then why are you here? Why not a question? When you showed up in the forge, I thought you had been sent to check out for me. My mission came directly from Tanya, you already know. No. I haven't been back to Tanya in a while, have I? Just for an artifact to protect the forge from the pain. But that would require you to go into the hole. I mean, we have been delayed too often and lost too many of our own. So it's agreed that some, they must be done. I create the mage bane helm to keep the vein at bay. Once the helm is in place, the magic will keep the vein locked away inside the hole.
But why did you create a helm? Could you create something out? Forge for armor crafters or weapons or armor, but I'm not statue problems. Make what I know. Some supported one could be moved easily or used to battle shares protection be needed out from the field truth. Time being, though, we remain here protecting the forge round. We have a job to do and cannot do it properly if we constantly suffer by outside forces. Yeah, well, why were you asked to create, the, create this thing? All parts of our masters of the craft, but each of us has a spatial talents. The major brain required 200 skills were well above those who have been practicing as long as I have. Tony wanted a master, but he said he asked the master. But that would require you to still. Anyway. Of course, this time I was sent by to ensure the forge round could continue to make it once with the disfavored. Then you are in luck. Once the helmet has been placed, the interruptions caused by the pain would no, be no more, and the forge round could truly return to the work. Oh, isn't that lovely? Everything seems to be I'll take my leave. As you wish, Faith, I was just on my way to place the helmet. But mind you, I'd like you to join us. So, as I correspond to the third tale, I will meet you now. Oh, so it's outside. Okay. That makes sense. I was going to say, if you're going to place inside the old walls, that's bad. We're going to have to uh, have a legal hearing about this. And the sons of peace and the jungle of rings will follow you in all things. Bye. Go on, so much go to the spot. Make sure everything's ready. I'll meet you there when Xander is ready to place the artifact. Like, if you think about it, we've already violated a lot of laws just by going into the old walls as many times as we have. I could talk to you guys, but I don't think you guys have anything new. Do you? You return. There's more demand for iron than there is time of day. And yeah, they have nothing to talk about. So we just leave them be. And then we can continue onwards. Which is, you know, it's odd that basically, hey, welcome back to this place. Nothing's really changed except for NPCs to have something new to talk about. Otherwise, it's the same as when you arrived first time. Yeah. First thing, there should be more side quests, you know. But, oh well. So, you guys want me to go to the third tail. There's a third tail? Unless it's uphill, I guess. Maybe this here's the third tail. Perp, perp, perp. Now, if you think about it, though, we're just going to place a helm out in the open. And expect no one to touch it. Yeah, you, you can see a problem with this, can't you? Ooh, pretty. It is done. Well, at least we have guards around it. Good, good. Now the people who left in crossing have one less thing they must worry about. Paper, will you go and say and see... <laughs> See, here's the thing. Ah, uh, they find her, can you go inside? Cause you know, you've already broken the law how many times? Carol's Leos says that no one's allowed to enter the old world, but if no one goes inside, we'll never know if the helmet is working. We gain major favor with them. I'm sure Tanya's gonna love the fact that I keep breaking the law and going inside these old walls. Yay. Thank you, Fake Binder. The Apples and Family Branches need to know my citizens are safe. Small stone with glyphs etched on it. this. It's the keystone to enter the old walls. I've been in there. I I've been in there. Yeah. But still, there's a problem here with the, you know. We're just gonna leave the helm outside. So if those guards aren't there, someone could easily just snatch that helm. But sure. <coughs> yeah. I'll go look at... There's gotta be a party before Venture Farm. There's gotta be a party before Venture Farm. So I think I'm paying a bit inspired. Diana's ashes to see with the oak walls. Yeah, well that's why I'm going inside as this keystone. 
Yeah, that would probably be for adventuring for. Oh yeah, wounds are clear for character gates to do lever or the poor dressed, which is how Yeah, I think th I thought that's how Lantry lost his wound when he leveled up. Yeah, he got his wound back when I reloaded. So Bear my life would end in the old walls, not saying I want to be proved right. At least not today. Wow, well, it's shaking. Um Okay, well the bane around. Come at me, grave me. Uh apparently that helm's not working. It's oh, so that's not good. Run, Consider land. it done. Run. <sighs> Come and face my iron! On your knees! Worm! Oh so <laughs> I'll take care of it. That was a huge spell when I got my toes in to her face. But I still can't get in there. So yeah, and I would just leave and tell them that, hey, that didn't exactly work. You know what the fun thing? We have to go all the way back up though, don't we? Oh. Well, that's a problem. Mage Fang on the pain of free to spare out the old one. So, what the hell did I miss? Hey, man, we need your help. The front over her attacking left is crossing, led by that bitch. Ring dropper Saranthal. I'll show you people in Cape Hood coming back. That is awkward. There's a thing. So, you could attack the front over her. You could betray a lion to terminate tap brokers. But we made sure I have. I don't know this grave doing to take weapons crushing for myself. Yeah, we're just going to Well, let's get it. let's just do what we came here to do. Let's be done with this country less fools. We will lend our strength for the glory of the north. Don't try to hold the line, they're in the center of town near the river. Hurry before we're overwhelmed. <sighs> you fucks. It's like, I see you red dot from the map. More <gasps> coming to the body cut! Worm. 
Ooh. That's a not bad bronze. I mean, it's a not bad weapon. The only problem, though, is it's about as useful as, well, a 90 chance of hammer. Anyway, let's go murder some more of them. Come at me, brave meat. Time to change weapons. That's failed, but oh well. Are you afraid of death, worm? This weapon is useless. You bleed out, you little shit. For the glory of Cairo! For the glory of Cairo. By the way, we're not done yet. There's still two more up there. It's just in case you came this way, you know. Also, with the I am a shield. Way, yeah, I should probably fall unto myself. Are you afraid of death, worm? Yes, combat serves are gonna go pretty fast with her sale because she, well, her level. And the fact that she's, well, she's a rogue. That double stabbing thing multiple times. But anyway, I think that's it. So we should probably go back and be like, hey, the hell happened? Okay, Primer, thank you for your help. I'm impressed by the speed in which you finished off. Oh, so it looks like they they broke my shit. I was going for what, five mi five seconds? And you guys let all this happen. So what the hell happened to the Mage Vein Helm? No idea. She's busy trying to uh, keep the upper hood from murdering everyone in town. Stuff to fight till we get back, though. Not sure if grab someone. Town's all what happened. Yeah, I was going for what? Five minutes and they broke buildings, damaged things. That guy has the helm. Roger, man, I said, Mark, you about you. Thank you, Paypinder. You provided better sense than they could have helped. So I needed to retrieve what I came for. Now I have work to do. I want to throw a rock at you. If I can move, you can scoop a rock from the ground and throw it at him. Trace the death person fast enough and the stone hits him right in the temple. He rides back home to have a large cash for on his head. Now it's not to speed, he thinks and runs away to the south. Shame, because usually when I throw a rock at someone, someone they die. Maybe that helm is protecting him. Where did he go downhill? Or did he go actually outside of town? Up, up, up. Look who's here, which is a bit l too late, aren't you? Now that I have the mage in the porch, found master, never can stop me from unleashing the pain on that friend's crossing. Rao to take a step to around him, who jumps back and puts up his hands in front of him. You notice one of his eyes is black and his nose is bleeding in addition to the what were you caught on his temple with the rock. You marvelous girl, Xander spits at him, lowers flare and blood, and she works her hands fighting against the bonds holding her. As soon as I free myself, and make no mistake, I will free myself. Your blood will join your underlings on my armor. Take more than a hammer to my head to take me down, coward. With your minutes of distraction, you know you are no match for me. Gonna take another step away from the center of your container. With the pain free, I will drive off the invaders that think this is their home and prove that the bronze brotherhood are the only ones strong enough to protect weapons crossing. Now you excuse me, I have a town to endanger so I can save it. <laughs> Sure, okay. Look at that, a future corpse. Sure, why not? Bleed out, you little shit! 
Oh god, I can't get it well. I can't. I can't. Get it well. Oh, so I want to point out something. The fuck did I take a wound from? No, seriously, the fuck did I take a wound from? Bruiser hits balls and hits with additional threat. Wound? They could just do that? They could just do that. Well, that explains what happens with Lantry, doesn't it? I didn't realize that AI had abilities that could just add wounds. I thought wounded was a you died condition. Take that! Well, that's Damn thing with your yeah. cloth! Oh, you're not going anywhere! No! I need to fall back. No. Do that. Ah. Harsh words. Well, oh, apparently we pissed them off enough that we gained that. You. Bronze Brotherhood are, are remembered as bronze. It, it makes sense. That's Bronze Brotherhood. Anyway, what do I have? Probably want more might. Yeah, I could go more wit. And more might. Save. Let's see, what do we have here? Magic's pretty good. Let's only go magic stick. And you know, arcane charge would actually be good. Since I do use the rest more now. Then I can work on power again. And let's go talk to Pandora again. My problem is though, there's only like five minutes and they just, you know, ransacked and bombarded my town and murdered everyone. I should wonder exactly how, <laughs> given how long we'll be. What time is she? Now I've edited it. Or I should wonder how bad the town is going to be after we get back. Once the bait start pouring out the old walls. Oh, hi. Good hill. Hey, Pat, come in. I was just told the news that the mage train helmets disappeared. This is terrible. Not just now. I heard fighting out there. Are there more of them? Uh, Ratchman stole the mage train helmet catcher's engine. This is an unacceptable. No, if we fail to protect the forge bound, I'll have the master be kidnapped. I'm going to go down the Brotherhood Cross and see if I can dig up any information. Come see me when you're done here. Yeah, your job is to protect the town. But you're not protecting the town. The town's in danger now. Just beginning to believe we were finally safe. Our celebration plan before it's time we're no doubt become awake. If I was in there was no chance of getting in our helm. So... I don't remember you guys being bothered by the bane before of making this helm. So why is it such a problem now? Friends, please go back to your homes for now. The paper is taking care of the invaders. Oh, it's what's on your bed. Oh, yeah. Bad. There's sounds of peace in the jungle of rings for fog and all things. Questions. Yeah, I didn't want to remember. might have taken on Xander. Bro doesn't like to stay in one place for too long, so I can't easily point you to the one location, I'm afraid. Havens for a thick forest to caravan routes and river crossings, so they like to make themselves at home at places that is like that for days at a time. Then just when wood would reach the travels of the will, bro, they pick up and move on, crafty fellows. Don't want to continue that routine with Zedra and the mage painted town, though. 
as if uh, he sometimes moves through the old walls, which on account of it being absolutely deaf, probably means that that's true. Ah, uh, so you mean he could be in the old walls. I would say it's fair. Not well, I'm afraid there's been some tension here and there with the Brotherhood, but by and large, they only never attacked people in the settlement. That's just the fair show of Amari, so believe it or not. At least it does the dead and more wounded. Most would stay inside and get out of harm's way, but everyone's rattled. That didn't make a lick of sense. Who'd say that everyone might not return for more? So how dangerous are things now about Mage Brain? Should be fair and more concerned about that helmet than Brotherhood on Rampage. It's true, we survived here for a long time without medical protection, but that situation can change as soon as you bring. Well, that's many years ago to think we bane had had with few and four between then. These have gotten separate attacks in the last few months. Something is driving the bane out of those old walls. Why do you think Zen was ordered to come here and deliver that fancy helmet? So why did they attack? As far as the same under my tats, so though perhaps they'll one and the same. Been around long enough to know how to spot the weed that was strangling your crops. The man has always carried a bit of poison inside him, even before Kairos kept the brotherhood out. Remember once burned a village to the ground to kill a rival that was hiding there with the help of some sympathetic folks? They had the village was raised armed against them, but. That's a little pig shit. He did because he was obsessed with getting vengeance, and so never let's go of obsessions. It's right for all wrong to be for so he left no stone on her until she was dust in the ground. Consequences be damned. My full notion and compelled him to order his man to come to left and cross and steal Mage Man. I guarantee you, it has everything to do with that obsessiveness. He hasn't changed all these years. There's something big he wants, rest assured. Right now, we're all in his way. So, what did he take? Pure captive? Mm, interesting question. Troopy told the porch behind the brother's brotherhood never really got along. The iron workers think of themselves as artisans and the brotherhood soldiers as dim witted thugs. They aren't workers without fancy swords. And see them as that. Wherever the parts of the forge from his doctor swords are the overlord, happy to trade their dignity for a mere since Deanfield prison they call the forge. I don't write my name to take Sandra, but frankly, she's just likely to cave his head on for hammer on any given day. Or he planned or not to give the forge brown though come up, it's probably something he just wants for years. Rumors about that word is that the leader's a paranoid sword, he sees conspiracy and betrayal every turn. I feel those the chance to come and go. Pretty sure they're not all failing in battle. Well, it's murder to feel them, too. Also. Tell me if that's the sort of man you're following. How long do you think it will be before someone else tries to take a claim? I know some brotherhood men and women in my time. I'd never call them wholesome, but not all of them are our swipes. This move by the is going to rip some of its folks the wrong way. Okay. Well, I guess we're gonna have to go look for him. So that's very convenient timing. Just as soon as we put the uh, go inside to put the helm, though. Oh, hey, the whole town just <laughs> attacked. Oh, so it's windy as shit outside. So, do you know anything yet? <coughs> <coughs> Go to see if I find her. Well, or you measure thief was that large. Yes, man, but. Oh, now we finally get this quest. Yes, by now, Gene was building some supplies from the sediment. Some time now, the last we've seen him was no deserters march. There's a size reward route for anyone who breeds this group for his demise. So you wait until now to give me this quest. Size for reward for a food snatcher. Isn't that a bit disproportionate? But the champ's is just in any thought of that. Anyway, it would be seen as weakness. Show you my this. I'll keep an eye out for Gino. Thank you, thank you, While we would like to see if the man from the rest, we will have to fight our time. We're also preparing for something to serve as March has become dense with brotherhood activity in the last few weeks. Coming to travel now will be tactical and sound, and we'll the patrols then and then begin your search. You're saying I shouldn't go, though, which means I should go, though. Don't have the same problems? We're an issue I could use to help with. I've got reports of Scar Corps moving throughout the region. See how smart a group of them conscripting themselves in nearby village. They struck quickly and moved on, leaving a small force behind. Best in the stands on Scepter, I want them to eliminate before a great and nice finds out their hill. 
Seem to have uh, kept some fear just behind his hostages. Destroy the course and free those people. We must do everything we can to weaken the course presence. And the terrorists have spread word of here today. Yeah, sure. So wait, that means I can't I can't get any answers to the one for Gino? Huh. Anyway, you're able to find anything on the bars that can help us find Rad. I believe so, but I don't like it. I heard, heard the rounds for we use the was a high price, but I don't believe it right now. There are items from these Barrowhood soldiers that came from inside the old walls. There's no entrance to the old walls in Trin Rivers. They were probably using that area as a base. I just you start that with cautious. Might be no bronze rover in the area and if Raven was so crazy as to read an attack like this, there's no telling what would be waiting for you. So what are you down about? I don't much about the area. I try to stay close to the crossing in case I'm needed. When the old world's entrance is mostly empty fear swept by the river, I can't imagine why everyone would go though. <sighs> so But okay, I can go though. So, we has stuff to do. Do I still have my wound? No way, I leveled up, so of course I don't. Right, convenient that. I think I could go into all these places here. But if I remember right, no one really had anything to do different. I have selling stuff to do. Oh yeah, I forgot there's one thing I can complain about in Tyranny. There's no pets in this one. Setting started that were, you know, Perils of Eternity. They really went overboard in Perils of Eternity too. But Tyranny, eh, Tyranny's a different game. Despite using the same engine. Different game. Don't need pets, apparently. Ah, uh, Faith Hunter. Come to stock up, I see. Also, apparently we don't need cloaks. Which is a bit unfortunate too. Apparently I'd like to see you out. Do you have anything new? No, you don't. Sad. Very sad. Yeah. I'm still surprised this armor's actually been better than, like, most armors you've got to find. They're a he heavy armor because most of them are, you know, frost armor, which is whatever. We haven't really been bothered that much. Arcane and Fire, sure, we've been bothered by. Anyway, so, welcome to what we have to do. We have Trin Rivers. The Motor Crossroads, we have Temper Those, which we've already dealt with. Ah, so here's the thing, we can't go to Desserts Marks. The Bronze Road had our in this area in the past, which is as much as the past search awareness. People are traveling here. You need to identify a section with known brotherhood activity. So we can't go there yet. We have to find out stuff. We're going to go to the... Well, first, we're going to quick save. Because traveling. Second, we're going to go down here to Merchant's Crossroads. Still trying to ponder how exactly I'm supposed to get to these spires. Because the game hasn't let me get over to those spires. I thought maybe we could go to that spire when we, you know. Oh, so that's where Neurant's at. I thought maybe we'd go to the spire once we, you know, went to the library, but since we're not going to the library, huh. But anyway, Merchant's Crossroads. Because first quest. And we have a new message from the forces of Narant. <laughs> you clearly remain woefully on practice at the fine art of setting insults to paper. We shall lock away the page you sent for the day when we require evidence of your impaired judgment and lack of impartiality. Probotonia should find the revelation intriguing, don't you think? With indescribable fondness, the forces of Narant. <laughs> we did tell him to shove her off. Oh, this doesn't even seem that big of a map. Oh yeah, it's probably just a... Uh, you talk to the person. 
Well, first thing I'm gonna loot your shit. Just water. Okay. Then I'm gonna talk to her. No, we're for business, friend. I'm not looking for trouble. As soon as I'm left his crush and spits, give the shipment shortly. I want to keep her waiting. Soft and well fed, this one, but look at her stats. She can handle herself. Excuse me. Eh, yeah, give us what we need to know. What did I say? I said, let me handle this. There's a mistake for someone else, I assure you. Oh, fine, the road to Star Wars is paved tonight. Bombs are zero, most of the animal. I don't know what I'm supposed to say. Bird of the hand is worth a torch and a cabbage patch. But no, it, it's. The papers are on plane. Please, I'm trying to work out. <laughs> Charming. So I write the poem, Melodies. <laughs> Before we get back to the four uses that were just cutting me, corn turns scary. Let's just say I prefer my e. tongue in my mouth and my bowels in my ear. Well, bowels, I guess. I know you. You were the governor of the cross, right? I tell you about me. Trey's coming to hell. Now for me. So what do you have for us? Right. Then you're interested in calls himself Kronkos. No idea whether that's why his mother named him. Showed him in the crossing field moments back picking fights and looking for rings. Been a fellow with the garrison and they stomped the pants gravy out of him. That cried him down for a bit, but when he started casting around for working, he posted his picture against the band of fairies during the war. They sailed back at the crossing. He had a story like that would scale off any potential employers. But Anissa's just never been the brightest ring on the rope. Who's Anissa? Clive off the door, reaching out there, zero. Runs a circuit from the crossing to the brewer, sent down into the calm edges of the blade grave. He hired a cross in a few hours last week, claiming he needed extra protection for his daughter. Why he brought his daughter to the crossing in the first place, the Silver Lord only knows. Thoughts? Shit sticks. I am easy to find a from between here and the flight grave. If you aren't very good, why do? He usually goes to Star Wars by way of the Ocean Spire, but he's, but he's cutting east to make time and avoid beast. Best place to wait for him here at Hunter's Respite. Why well, can't you tell me about Hunter's Respite? Small stretch of wilderness far enough off the trade road to destroy traders, but near enough to avoid losing much time. Isolation recommends it, but not much else. Not that Respite's starting to get well, too well known as a stopover. I will really yield before thieves start hitting it. So I'm supposed to wait for him and hope he shows up? Have you wanted to catch Gronkers? Yes, I'm just taking the stone route out of Haven, so. He'll almost certainly stop though, he's not made a great secret about being a his favorite dressing stop around these parts. Thanks. Yeah, thanks for making this bastard we're open and you have a ball to chin. You know everything I know about this so called fairy slider. If you have any other questions, you have to ask someone else. By half you have to murder them. I'm pretty sure this is gonna be end up being one of those quests well, he's just one who's gloating about that and isn't actually, you know. Probably hasn't actually done anything. But anyway, John just respired. Yeah. Well, well, uh, well, making an unarmed character would have, would have gone. Since there isn't exactly a monk system in this. You know? Hmm. Anyway. Slow and steady. Slow and steady, look for traps and all that. Hi. Boo. As you approach the Well, left is crossing well, this is gonna get bad. You approach the bronze Clad cavalry guards, they look up as one, leaving dice and rings on the ground as they. as their hands move to weapons. Who goes down? Actually, know what? It doesn't matter. Turn back the way you came. Strange, but things will get. Blow for her. 
quickness. I'm Kelvin, Vanguard, but not the Kelvin. Why are you over here? What the hell is any of your business? Pay guards. We get paid to guard. We don't pick where we guard, and we don't ask why about the will. That made sense, right? I understand. Per I understood perfectly. Of course you did, Bronze Brain. If you have questions in the advance, you speak to Crocus. Find him up the hill to the west. Oh, well, we're looking for him. Oh, he's not over here, is he? You don't know him by sight, you idiot. Shut her up before I shut her up for you, Winces. Oh, fine. Tell us where we lay out and we'll leave it be. Go back the way you came, then head up north, up the uh, incline. Crocus is down at the camp. I could have murdered them, but since they are, you know, with the left hand crossing, I figured, nah. Talk with them, man, Bronson, Lever, Scrooge, and nice to your approach. Fucking phone. Okay, where the fuck was I? Talk with him, man, Bronze, and Lover Scrooge and Ashes approach, hand on the hilt of his blade. That's well enough, stranger. Oi, Crockett, we've got company. A massive man answers the lookout's cry. His approach marked by a pronounced swagger. Crocker's wears some massive hats on his. They like to say massive, don't they? On one broad shoulder, his hair seems to have migrated largely from his scalp to his chin. And the veins of his temper stand out against his massively deeply tanned skin. <laughs> that didn't sound right, though. Besides Cairo here, oh, got an entire squad behind me. Spirits warriors all, so I'm left wondering who the fuck are you? I like this one. I'm here for Crocus. The rest of you have this one chance to leave her your gut still inside you. Turn the mercy show a look of concern before shaking and backing away from the rest. Oh, let's beach it. Hey, speaking of beast. Trid snap on her first. Hugh Crocus the forest turn and flee. He turns back to you, cheeks flushed with rage. Size guy we have kind of <laughs> Yeah, an entire squad of two just left. I thank Barry Paulson, but more importantly, this is verse. I vow to advocate your head open just as for my fairy sisters. Oh shit, to arms to arms. So we have Beastman. And carry on. And them over there, who aren't very gonna help. More tallies to the body count! Lantry? Just say. Anyway, you know what to do. First, I don't really know what to do with you. You have too many abilities, and yeah. Have you set your blade down, sir? Eh, I'd fast for you. I should use fire stick for myself. Consider it done. I'm not <laughs> Oh, the fuck 
is <laughs> 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 Oh no, for the love of Kairos. How like you had one your you and your friends killed my fucking sisters for the love of Kairos indeed. Her words escape her clenched teeth in a half hissed breath. She slips a small knife from her boot and a flash of bronze opens the fallen man's cheek. Oh please wait, I'm not proud of what I did back then. I'm changed man as well by the old lord. I've got a wife now. She's asleep right over there. Oh hi. I honestly Living by the damn ads, I protect licensed traders. You're the one who's been boasting about all over Haven. But no need to understand, I couldn't find work otherwise. Then maybe I could win a few fights in the cross and prove my metal, but the fucking guard that would jump me as a group. They had to tell people about the furries. It was the talk about your. the fur. the theories. Not furries. It was talk about your sisters for starving and let my wife starve. Is this better than starving? Boo comes down hard on his ankle and sang an audible snap. Sound dissipates into a scream. I, oh Lord, help me. I never want to hurt anyone. It's my damn job. I swore an oath to you. I put slow because I wanted bed and food, not because I thought Kairos would ever come to the tills. They will uh, just dissolve when your armies pass the gates of judgment. I had to kill conscripted tillsmen by the gang, and yes, I helped kill your friends. Not friends, asshole. Sisters. This thing was my idea. The tourists had the location just like Bash went to cook them with his flames. Richard she went to hunt furry <laughs> theories. Wanted to head on a, a pike she could wave her energy for battle. I was following orders. Who? I don't know if you saw him eat someone, but I'm sure he did. You could see it in his eyes when he looked at you. The hunger, he was a sage. And that's why it's overload notes with those scroll fuckers doing their life furries. Certainly not cannibalism, and copulating with scrolls has been frowned upon for centuries. <laughs> well, there you go. We took one of you alive, you know. But, what the fuck are you talking about? After you disappeared, we realized that one of your fairies was still alive, the big bald one. Katara struck her. Now it's our after. Liar, she punches him again and again. Where can we find Arisa? Like I said, Arisa burned with the fire of revolution after Ape had saw that crazy bitch couldn't lay down a spill. That's who she was down Blazegrave during with the Star Wars shit hills. Killed his favorite overlords in the Storm Hill. Torn Strand. This was from her. She wanted me to come find her and take up arms again. During my backup change. I love the overlord. Praise Kairos. Where's Katoris now? Now you know. I swear everything you know when I tell you if I knew. He probably died in the year of fire, search and rave, so. Not why we deserve this treatment more than me. I didn't want to play this verse. It's just a delicious tragedy, I'll give you that. That's right. That's so a bloody ending. She fingers the edge of her small bronze knife. I've sworn loyalty to Kairos. Go hunt Arisa. Go kill Ka Katoris. They're your true enemies. They're the ones who deserve your justice. Tony Will grasps his gold magic beard. She jerks his chin upwards and places the knife against his exposed throat. Please. I'm just going to say nothing. This one's for Seeking Chief. She rounds a blade into his eye, twisting it roughly and digging it deeper into his skull as he screams. He barks and spasms wildly. I carry it off completely silent. Barak watches with crossed arms. We both we both chose a silent path. Taste faint binder. <laughs> so what about you? Arissa's next. Let's go find her. She turns to go but comes to a stop instead. That's our quiet spot. Sign looks back to you. Seeking was special, you know. I know. Let's go. Find a glass of the blood wreck you've made of Hunter's despite you. Falls in behind you. A young one lies on the bed with her brief is thrown. Oh shit. <laughs> First peers down the sleepy girl whose tightly curled hair is still half others who are around her caramel brown features. She drops to an knee. Checking out Kairos' carcasses captive. 
Your eyes fly open, staring blankly at the pupils, reducing a cloud with brown iris as thin rings. Father, wh where's Father? Wait, I thought. Wait, 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 wait. I thought. I thought. He said his wife was sleeping over there. That's his daughter, what do you. Unless I saw a. Wait, I'm. I'm confused. <laughs> What do you think, Forsyth? Wait, well, maybe he... Okay, anyway. <laughs> oh, fuck. So, Joe, what do you think, Forsyth? Joe, gently to stand up looking to you. for some supplies and have to go back to the crossing. This route and drain the car too and clock carry it. See when she has any appetite after seeing the slaughter. Let's go fate by I'm sick of this place. Like I I could have but nah. Maybe my maybe some niceness is getting back into me. So I didn't just, you know, smile for her. Once that car seems to have been hastily hidden behind some forage, and several crates filled with boats of unspoiled cloth and unspoiled food. By the way, you guys, cause you guys are Ed's pain. I am a shield wall unto myself! <laughs> Wait, I did that? Ah! Nice! Boop. Boop. This isn't working. For you, Matt. Are you afraid of death, worm? The only problem with those, how do, does that... No! Despite being left in crossing, they didn't give a shit that we murdered them. Nice. Nice. I can work with it. So this is going to be more intricate than I thought it was going to be. We need to go to numerous locations and hunt down numerous Numerous people. It's like we need to go to Torn Strand. We need to go someplace over hill, but we don't know yet. So let's just go to this one. Another day. Yeah. Remember, hey, God, let's change how much unarmed da arm unarmored damage you do. I'm probably sure we look for traps, you know. Down torture and hangs since entirely undisturbed by any breeze. As if the now broken eater of storms had exhausted there is propensity for wind. Storms dead really sides in you. A haggard group of soldiers in torn fronts await you. One man steps forward, pulling off his helmet to reveal a grime rough and face of deep umber, cross hatched with pale scars. If it isn't Graven Ashes Harlot, the Freight Finder. I am Dotsro, son of Taranos, and I will be both honor and pleasure to remove your motherless head from your shoulders. Which one of you is Arissa? What could someone like you possibly want from Arissa? I very much have words for her. Very much words for her. I'm broken. Lead ball bike. Not wrong. Now yeah, we're here to kill her. Wait, it's part of the surprise, Fanny Potters. Yeah, she grins hungrily. Suppose your court judge should guilty of some capital crime in Absentia. 
I go to the board before, well, before I allow a whore cars to take anyone who is bled for stalwart. Do the void then. Let's say we kill them and figure out which one it was for us afterwards. Well, I haven't had enough intros today. For three whispers. That you're the one we call the unbroken. Well, none of them have the name Marissa on them, so. Send them at me in waves! Oh, you already cast that? Why'd you already cast that? Anyway, let's do this the usual way. Back when you're done with that. <laughs> this isn't working! That required they sail back, though. This isn't working. Time to change weapons. <laughs> I don't think so. Oh. I'm on it. Oh, yeah, of course you did. Shit, now these people are over there when my sister died. Death bodies with me, maybe there's something here that'll help. These are such as Dr. Lee's remains, shifting his dead weight, and annoying the drip of gore to each of his belongings. Your hand comes away wet, clutching a royal parchment tightly wrapped bundle. What have you got there? See for yourself. She locks eyes where you snatch the fire and looks over for a shake of her head. She starts to scroll back towards you. You can't read or leave me guessing. Alright, you can't read. Anyway, read the note. You write the serial and unroll the message. The parchment is a letter in clean hand language, surprising clear and crisp for tears. I to see to whoever succeeds him. I came to start with Lidro. Didn't need for the fight, only these gloves are trophy for my skirmish long past. Should I follow a trap or junction? Please see to it that they return to my sister. Clear out our family tomes and rivers. Break an apex. Hope to use them well, and I wish I could have been there to deliver them myself. Thank you for this, Arissa. One of these glo gloves given to her sister, Clear of Rivers. Say gloves? Search a level package to test open, review a pair of gloves and suffer a level edge from a series of sharper bronze blades. Fuck it, me, it's these. You know these gloves? They fall into one of my fairies. Search has sister, sister for a sister then. What's some poetry in it? Are you suggesting what I think you're suggesting? If I'm this clear, she must know something about who Arissa ran with during the war, right? And who knows, maybe she'll turn out to be someone in need of a good stabbing through the face. Yeah, it's been a while since we gave someone a good face stabbing. Literally minutes. You proud of me? I'm proud of me. Come on, screw this place. As you turn your gun to the hand rest on your shoulders. Yes, I know. Mold binder. Well, it's about... I know her first for years now. She's always been... Insightful. This is different. She seems rapid. He lives in danger. Like the worst of the course instead of the best. Notice that. My mask is to keep an eye on her, for her well being rather than just yours. Though, first of all, my soldier tried want her as clutch as possible. That may never be an option. Eh. Uh, better do I can. Thanks for helping me out with Fate Binder. Because Barrick actually sort of cares for her in a, in a way, because they're sort of related. And sure, I'll just take all this stuff. 
I'll just take all the stuff. And I'll be about my merry way. So now I need to go to Will. Ah, back hill. River speak. Ah, we have encountered something. As you walk along the bank of a small stream, you are slashing over the beach hours and river. Hey, it's a rush fish again. We shall hunt it with a lure. And thus we had rush fish. Ooh, an actual town. Oh, you built that that weapon that I was going to go to first. Well, we'll have to go back again for that before we remove it from the party, won't we? So... Pie. No woman tends to a small part for a patch of farm. Plump your gourds and vegetables are fine. And root five for soil and light with a fig tree. Brown to stoop him with what passes for buns and tips. Or no, she's about to taste of her shoulder as if her spell favoring her left arm with a wince. Come on, strange, I'm no easy mark. Little worth your time of blood. Your hand shines a thick gray hair loosened. And the band that tames the rest can frame her deeply white face. Hmm. Maybe old enough to be a mob, but she goes herself like a warrior trained. See clear. Clear? Clear is my youngest. What are you asking after? What? Shit, don't turn over to a I hope you keep a silver tongue in your head, girl, while you're on my land. She jabs her show in first direction if she could seal the fairy's mouth with it. Sorry, ma'am. First blink that surprised our own words. I already clear. Now to eyes of parents hanging potatoes around the shovel. First thing first, call me Edison. Daughter of the Sparrow. It's my homestead. Grand me by Queen the Vendry and Atlanta and honor my service. And she swings the service head to come come to the small plastered house in the fine field. That's an introduction. You got one to match? Okay, fine. I'm bored, fake binder turned in the abdicator. You're the one who's in the mountain spire. Oh yeah, by the way, you guys really hate me. They say you, you hung a banner over a golden life in the battlement. I believe the word of it if I hadn't seen the glow from hell. There's a vapor almost as long as me. I ain't broken the overlord's laws. Eh, you might follow your lead first. Uh, I'm sorry, yes, but... Arisa has died. First frowns down at her scarred hands and glances away. Mr. Dirko. Dear stupid blind force delicate girl. What happened? And she died in Stone Day in the Unbroken against the Force of Kairos. It's my fault. I raised the girls in the Romance War. They were so bloody in the bastard tail and pushing back as there. But as you know, you always become in their lifetimes. I guess the judgment won't hold. Leave you straight into the territory of a man of stone who could step clean over a curtain wall. Even girls like mine couldn't stand against Kairos. There ain't been nothing like that in Northern Shadow before. Able to crush mounds of call earthquakes from a scrap of Valium, though ain't no fighting that, I told them. They didn't listen, damn them. Of all the damn fool things I told them, the only thing they didn't hear was what mattered. Well, first, Mercenary left his crossing by the name of Crockett's point as Charles Arrested. Paint her a much more vicious kill than you have. Marcus, I ain't never heard the net. She paused recognition, full of liquid between her white eyes. Bald bearded man, skin the color of bronze, and thick as a beast man. You can tell a different name. Great lazy bastard by my reckoning. Only thing he did much effort into was lying his way into the mail and a song of rings, but just as though a man like him lives while my rest has met the void. Their justice were slow and terrible. Aye, that's some comfort though. You know, Katoris, Sage, was an old gentleman, smarter than most, like he had the whole 
Pound him, consider it'll bounce around on his head. Tad often that way, magicians so often are. Eyes as hungry as flame. So you turned your daughters in the art of battle? I think the foe was a good man, but more suited to farm work than war. If you're looking for someone to blame, it'd be that person. I trained them up tougher than the fox, the javelin, and the spear and shield. I think they used that garbage, that knowledge, <laughs> that knowledge against your precious archons and the armies. Yes, yeah, so maybe you'd like to shut the fuck up now. What do you teach them about the Overlord? Eh, that there's no very great for threat to all terrorists, that the cowards represent the worst of the powers of man or, or woman, that such an evil must be resisted at all costs by any means necessary. What, that directly contrary just what you said before? I changed my two in my older, softer years, but as they grow up, I poison them against cowards as theory is a cart upon the heart. Years old as far as how have you sold to out people in the well? So it's time for rings and without Cairo rules. Damn license, too. So you met your final line Cairo's law in front of a chronicle. Wow, young lady, this is going in a permanent record. Hey, grandfather, do you have considered showing you for the comes? Anything else you want to tell me? Name a tribe for Cairo's as a capital offense, ain't it? Imagine naming a pig for Cairo's, ain't it? No better. Come to me, Cairo's the old for pig, he's around back. You see what's happening here, don't you, Binder? Yep. What matter? There's no matter, Binder. Please tell me you're not going through with this. Decisions, everyone. So here's the thing. Apparently murdering her makes them all sort of I don't like this. Yet she's clearly trying to provoke me. You know what? This is your dance first. Pick the tune. Quite scraping our issues from Barrack as he watches wordlessly. Really? First, takes a step back, blinking, back, ra blinking rapidly, considering options for a of weapon nods. Came here because of Rissa. She killed one of my sisters. I always thought I needed to avenge them, to make it right, because I failed them. But after talking to you, I always cleared some stuff up. Guess what I'm saying is I miss my sisters. You miss your daughters, and that's just the way of things. There's an odd anomaly. Turn to Shepherd's Torture Squad for Farmhouse. Then, that's how it ends. First release is long side, bends down and plucks around Reggie Mayo from a vine. Thumb slides around its skin, then presses lightly against it, dimpling the vegetable. She tosses it from hand to hand and turns to you. Dunhill. I'm sure Whispers would have something clever to say about frustrated ambitions. You ever have a friend who almost never speaks? But then, every once in a while, she slips in the perfect word at the perfect time, and it's the only thing you remember. That was three whispers. Dick waffles. She was our wiry, flickering shadow with hair like crow's feathers. Preferred close-up work. That was her name, her three knives, and the sound of air from a punctured lung. It's, uh... Hard to remember stories about her, because she never drew attention. Her old favorite. <laughs> that I remember. She'd trick a soldier into gutting his own comrade, then open his throat while he was in shock. Beautiful move, and I, I saw her dance it a dozen times. Whispers knew her histories and letters, knew borders and houses and heraldry. Even knew a few sigils, and kept us from bleeding out more than once. Whispers and me, we were more than sisters sometimes. Not often, and <laughs> nothing holding. 
Ah, <sighs> but yeah. She read a body as oh, easy wow. as a scroll. Sound nice. Was nice. Well, let's go. Let's. <sighs> so where's this Kairos the Orphan Piggy? I do not see this Kairos the Orphan Piggy. Could you have lied to me? Probably. And yes, I know the spire has my thing done. I will get to it when I can. The only problem though is do we actually learn? Yeah, that's the thing. We didn't actually learn about that one. It just sort of ended. Also, if we compare evidence, there's still more evidence against the forces of Nurad than Craven Ash. Yeah, I think it's time we head back. Because apparently we didn't learn anything about, well, the mages. Which is unfortunate. Not sure if we should take her to the bastard's room to see if there was anything new, because I doubt there was anything new. Pretty sure it's mostly just done. Bye, my bastard spire. Cause yeah, that was a thing. So I'm guessing it's sort of like Barrett's thing. We'll basically we've completed the quest, but yet we haven't completed the quest. We completed what we could for the quest. So anyway, first, uh, I need you to take all that off. Yeah, you can have your old hood back. Oh, so Tom, let's go back in mail. You can keep that, though, and... Oh, yeah, I still need to get you your other... thing. Yeah, you can keep Grape, though. So that means we'll probably go teleport to that one first. By my revenues... Do you have more iron? You have more iron. More hides? Yes. More scrolls? Yes. <coughs> I'm not entirely sure why I need the scrolls, but you know. Also, Weeping Whispers. Oh, that's a thing. Cool. Yeah, you know, I'll probably give those to Verse, actually. Would make sense. Hey, Verse. You have to get gloves. Yay. Hi, Long Fang. Do you have anything for me? Oh, you have one of those. Um, promise I forgot to do something. I forgot to actually sell my shit to purse. Just remember, I do have a bunch of shit, so I can't sell that. That would be stupid if I could sell it anyway. Don't want to sell that. I could, hey, I, I could go for that with a bronze guitar. If I made that one blade for her, so I might as well give her that. Whoa, 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 don't sell those. And let's get some actual armor. I didn't say it, click on that tab. You know, I probably have some armor in here somewhere. All these scavenger things, after all. I 
I was gonna say, sure, I have, you know, stuff that's armor. Ah, right, here we go. Okay. Wait, do I have boots? Boots. Yes, boots. Oh, now she actually has stuff. Yay. Anyway. Look at that assassin go. The assassin one back in. Left hand's thing would actually be probably better for her. Now that I think about it. Whoops. Oh well, I, mean, I can do that real quick. Let's go to the weapons cross. Poof. We'll just go pick this up. After all, I can upgrade it if I really want to. We have the money now that, you know, doesn't really matter. Down overrun by Bane yet? Because <laughs> it has been a few days. Alright, ah, uh, shit, which one of you merchants was it, though? That's the question. I know it was one of you. I can't remember which one, though. Gonna get you fire tongue, poisonous. Eh, okay. I'll show you... No, not you. You. Let's see what you has. Assassin's Raymond. Yeah, sure, why not. Let me go back over here to verse. Sure. Could be better, but oh well. Meh. Very right, reps for that. That's the thing. Yes, you do. Thanks. So first. Well. Lovely. And that's probably all you really need. That's why uh, you afford me something else. Yeah, that's meh. So I can make that one. I can make that. Well, I can't. Alright, Crashing Thunder. So what does this do? So, devastating, of course. Static. Eh, it's not terrible. It's just, you know. I mean, it's not terrible. It's just I have... I have how many hammers? Is that right? Anyway. Hi. Hi, Ab. What is it you need? Of course. 
Bye, Verse. Goodbye to you, too. Hi, Ev. Hi, Siren. Good day, Fatebinder. It's always... What do you need? Why do you have nothing new to say? Anyway, uh, well, first things first, you need this stuff again. Secondly, you've leveled up somehow. What do I want you to have? Or might, for some reason? Afflictions. Or moonlight. Eh, afflictions, why not? Okay, well, is there anything I need to craft? I mean, my stuff's good. Barrack stuff's good. Minus his armor, which I could. I mean, I could technically make bad, but I don't want to yet. Your stuff? Oh, jeez, I really wish we had more stuff, you know? We have just enough to upgrade one piece. Yay. And that's all we can afford to do. Shame that. I could upgrade Lantry's Quill. Anyway. Alright, oh, you don't have the buff. Uh, well, in that case. Let's rest here for a minute. Then we hop down. Do that thing. Then we'll call the video. And that's so we can deal with whatever out stuff we have to deal with. That was very morally gray style request, the whole do you wanna do do you wanna let her give into her anger and vengeance and murder all these things? But she started growing there towards the end. And did it murder as much as we thought she was going to. Which is nice, I guess. Oh, it's still better than, oh, yeah, let's just smother her. <laughs> Jeez, game. And Tyranny, one of the few games that's like, hey, do you want to go s murder a baby? Because you could totally do it. You should totally do it. No, game. <laughs> That's a bit much, don't you think? You should totally do it. Anyway. Ting, ting, ting. So what else do we have to do? I'm going to take and go to Trim Rivers. Go to Timberfell Village. Go to... can't go there because of reasons. And keep mate and keep claiming those things. By the way, we still haven't found a way to get to those albums. Jeff, we haven't gone to those albums yet, really. Unfortunate that. The other thing, one of my favorite things about this game, though, is the fact that it varies a lot depending on your choices. Like, we could betray our alliance and go on our own. We could side with the uh, voices of Norant instead of Graven Ash. Like, we could have helped the rebels. We could have made favor with them, instead of, you know, them hating me completely. Oh hell, that broken almost got up though. 
Some sea villagers sort of like me. Lapis Crossing really likes me. Forge Bound. That's a bit sad. Look at that. Look at that. Look at that. Right at the edge. But yeah, most of them really like me. By the way, so next time we go to one of the little areas. I haven't decided which yet. By the way, oh yeah, I should probably do this. Hope you all enjoyed. Thank you all, and have a nice day.